Yo, what's going on YouTube? Penguin Zombie here, back with another YouTube video, and today we're looking at best hiding spots in unnamed locations. Uh, this will be part one out of many series. I'm sure when season eight comes out, you know, the map will change and we'll keep doing the series. But anyway, starting off, our first spot is going to be at Motel, and this is how you can get behind the boxes that's inside the 18-wheeler. Uh, you can't just jump in there usually and, and you know, get the chest, um, but you can go on this, this edited uh, wall and then jump on the boxes and go behind them, and boom, you're in. Uh, amazing spot for an ambush. Um, definitely a great spot for hide-and-seek. I guarantee no one's going to see it coming. So, just a great spot. Now, moving on, this is in the soccer field slash rec area. Not sure what to call this place. But um, if you go in through the buildings and then go up through the garage, uh, everything on the outside stays intact, like the garage door and all that. And you can actually get inside the roof up here by breaking the inside wall um, and then you can pretty much ambush anyone below you it's just it's an amazing spot especially to chill out or if you're in the final circle need the heal you know whatever but um yeah definitely a great spot to keep in mind uh, usually I go through the garage door but I just found out this new way so I just go through the bathroom instead but yeah moving on our next spot is near Paradise Palms it's gonna be on the bridge uh, there's actually quite a few spots here uh, but we'll, we'll get to that later. This first spot, you want to go inside this gray house and then destroy the floor with uh, the sleeping bag on it. And once you do that, you can actually drop down into a hollow area that's behind this fence right here. And it's made to be a hiding spot because uh, they put some barrels out in front of it, you know, just to, for some extra protection. And uh, it's, it's just an amazing hiding spot. But um, just keep in mind that to get out of here, you do have to destroy something, which is going to cause a lot of noise in time so not really good for a quick escape anyway moving on this spot is in cargo or i guess that's what i call it containers i'm not sure you know what everyone else calls it but if you destroy this crate up here you can get in and drop down into a little crevice and uh the good part about this crevice is that you can shoot from two ways and, and, you, and you can look from two ways so you have pretty good visibility and no one's really going to look for you up here um, especially if you're wearing a dark skin but um, just a great spot, especially for hide and seek. But yeah, so moving on. Now this kind of house is, it's located all throughout the map. Um, this one's next to Lonely Lodge, but it doesn't really matter which one you choose. You can go into any of these red houses right here, these red huts, by building a pyramid and then squeezing in through the window. It's a pretty good strategy. No one, no regular player really knows about this, so if they see the hut that has the wooden things on it, they're not going to think that anyone's in there, so great spot for an ambush. Now this spot is similar to the Tilted Tower spot. It's getting behind the tires at the RV park. Um, there's a variety of tire locations throughout the map, but that was just one of them, so definitely a great spot to keep in mind. Now this next one is inside the Tomato Temple Tunnel. Um, you just build up here any way you want, and you have to destroy one of these metal roof pieces. And the the entire space above the metal roof pieces is hollow, and if you wanted to, you can destroy one of the walls and go back even farther, uh, which is definitely what I recommend doing. Um, but yeah, and you can partially destroy one of the metal uh, roofs and then shoot through it and drop down on anyone and ambush them, so amazing spot. Definitely recommend it. Now this next one is also at cargo slash containers. Uh, you can destroy this wall right here behind this chest spawn. And you can get inside this hollow container uh, that's behind the dumpster. And uh, no one's really going to look for you back here. There is a floor loot spawn back here, so just keep that in mind. Uh, you're, you're most likely likely to find something back here. So And then you can open up a door in the back for you know an added ambush element if you want to surprise anyone coming down there. But now this next spot is going to be on the bridge near Paradise again. And you can get behind the wall that the chest spawn is at. And uh, so, you know, you can ambush anyone behind there. Now, I do recommend that uh, you just get the chest and run anyway because they, I'm pretty sure they can see you through the fence. But, you know, if, you know, I guess it's a good hide-and-seek spot or whatever. But this next spot right next to that chest spawn is probably better. Um, just because you have more visibility, you know, and you're a little bit more hidden, and they have to look up to see you, so you can drop down on anyone, or shoot across, you know, definitely a great spot, and you don't need to destroy something to get out of here, so that's always a plus. Now this next spot is in Viking Village, we got one spot from here in this video, 
and uh, you just want to make your way back to this corner and then you can jump behind the fences so it's uh, nothing too fancy but uh, definitely want to throw it in this video because it is a pretty decent spot but um, not legendary by any means now this next spot is at the hero mansion or whatever people want to call this place I have no clue what this place is called um, but you want to go to either side of, of, of the building and then you can destroy the walls that are in front of the, the bushes and uh, and it works on this side and the other side and there's enough space to, to squeeze down and uh, and be hidden just keep in mind that you have to destroy the bush uh, while you're hiding in there to get out so yeah something to keep in the back of your mind this next spot is at factories I guess you would call it again I don't know what these names of these unnamed locations are but I just call this this place OG factories and uh, anyway you can get on top of the sink and then jump inside the bathroom stall and you can get inside of any of the bathroom stalls in this game uh, this one is just special because it has a really high roof so you can just jump in there real easily but yeah moving on this next spot is in containers or cargo whatever and you can go underneath there's a huge hollow area underneath the staircase right in here and I just built an inverted pyramid because it's really hard to tell that someone's up here from the bottom if they're just running through and I guarantee no one's gonna see this coming especially if you drop down on them ambush them there's a floor loose spawn right below you so it's it's just a great spot to camp out for an ambush so moving on this next spot is gonna be at the villain base the rocket base again no clue what to call this place but uh, just let me know in the comments what you guys call this place but yeah you can go up in this little corner right here some of it did get destroyed so there's some cracks to the wall but it is still a good spot regardless this next spot is right next to the other villain base hiding spot you can get above this staircase right here and there's a couple loot spawns right below you so it is pretty good for an ambush but this is be probably best out you know best spot to chill out I drink a chug jug whatever uh, I don't experience a lot of foot traffic in this area so I can't really imagine that this spot would be that good for an ambush but uh, definitely a great hiding spot that's for sure uh, the log cabins located all throughout the map uh, there's one right here there's one next to fatal fields there's some everywhere and you can get inside the roof right here the roof itself is hollow and um, there is an ammo box spawn up here so if you're low on ammo you need to get some ammo you need to hide whatever this is a great spot for you now, this is our last spot of the video guys this is right next to the bridge near paradise uh, really simple to get in here all you need to do is whack down the uh, the wood right there and hop in but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, if you did give it a thumbs up if you're new around here uh, subscribe and with that being said I will see you guys in my next video